So in this video, we have a particle of mass 0.25 kilos is moving with a velocity of 3i plus 7j meters per second when it receives the impulse 5i minus 3j newton seconds. Find the speed of the particle immediately after the impulse. So we know that the impulse is the change in momentum. Now, the impulse here is 5i minus 3j. The mass is 0.25, and that's times by the uh, velocity, uh, which is the 3i plus 7j. But that is the initial velocity. Okay, So we want to find the final velocity here, and then find the speed. So 0.25v, take away 0.25 times by 3i plus 7j meters per second. So the velocity is, so if we deal with the i components, we've got 5, then plus 0.25 times 3, and I need to divide that by 0.25, we get 23i, then minus 3, plus 0.25 times 7, and then divide it by 0.25. So let's take away 5 j, and that's meters per second. So that is the final velocity. So the speed is equal to the square root of 23 squared plus negative 5 squared, square rooted. So square root of 23 squared plus 5 squared is the square root of 554, uh, which is 23 0.5 meters per second to three significant figures.